Ziggurats were massive structures built in the ancient Mesopotamian valley and western Iranian plateau, having the form of a terraced step pyramid of successively receding stories or levels. Notable ziggurats include the Great Ziggurat of Anir Nazariya, Iraq. The Ziggurat of Akhuf near Baghdad, Iraq. The now destroyed Eti Mananki in Babylon. Chuzambal and Kazesta N, Iran. And Chialg near Kashan, Iran. Description Ziggurats were built by the Sumerians, Babylonians, Elamites, Akkadians, and Assyrians for local religions. Each ziggurat was part of a temple complex which included other buildings. The precursors of the ziggurat were raised platforms that date from the Yabade period during the 4th millennium BC. The earliest ziggurats began near the end of the early dynastic period. The latest Mesopotamian ziggurats date from the 6th century BC. Built in receding tiers upon a rectangular, oval, or square platform, the ziggurat was a pyramidal structure with a flat top. Sun-baked bricks made up the core of the ziggurat with facings of fired bricks on the outside. The facings were often glazed in different colors and may have had astrological significance. Kings sometimes had their names engraved on these glazed bricks. The number of tiers ranged from two to seven. It is assumed that they had shrines at the top, but there is no archaeological evidence for this and the only textual evidence is from Herodotus. Access to the shrine would have been by a series of ramps on one side of the ziggurat or by a spiral ramp from base to summit. The Mesopotamian ziggurats were not places for public worship or ceremonies. They were believed to be dwelling places for the gods and each city had its own patron god. Only priests were permitted on the ziggurat or in the rooms at its base, and it was their responsibility to care for the gods and attend to their needs. The priests were very powerful members of Sumerian society. One of the best preserved ziggurats is Chuzambal in western Iran. The Shialk ziggurat, in Kashan, Iran, is the oldest known ziggurat, dating to the early 3rd millennium BC. Ziggurat designs ranged from simple bases upon which a temple sat, to marvels of mathematics and construction which span several terraced stories and were topped with a temple. An example of a simple ziggurat is the White Temple of Uruk, in ancient Sumer. The ziggurat itself is the base on which the white temple is set. Its purpose is to get the temple closer to the heavens, and provide access from the ground to it via steps. The Mesopotamians believed that these pyramid temples connected heaven and earth. In fact, the ziggurat at Babylon was known as Eti Menankia or House of the Platform between Heaven and Earth. An example of an extensive and massive ziggurat is the Majuk ziggurat, or Eti Menanki of ancient Babylon. Unfortunately, not much of even the base is left of this massive structure, yet archaeological findings and historical accounts put this tower at seven multicolored tiers, topped with a temple of exquisite proportions. The temple is thought to have been painted and maintained in indigo color, matching the tops of the tiers. It is known that there were three staircases leading to the temple, two of which were thought to have only ascended half the ziggurat's height. Eti Menanki, the name for the structure, is Sumerian and means Temple of the Foundation of Heaven and Earth. The date of its original construction is unknown, with suggested dates ranging from the 14th to the 9th century BC, with textual evidence suggesting it existed in the second millennium. Interpretation and significance, according to Herodotus, at the top of each ziggurat was a shrine, although none of these shrines have survived. One practical function of the ziggurats was a high place on which the priests could escape rising water that annually inundated lowlands and occasionally flooded for hundreds of miles, for example the 1967 flood. Another practical function of the ziggurat was for security. Since the shrine was accessible only by way of three stairways, a small number of guards could prevent non-priests from spying on the rituals at the shrine on top of the ziggurat such as cooking of sacrificial food and burning of carcasses of sacrificial animals. Each ziggurat was part of a temple complex that included a courtyard, storage rooms, bathrooms, and living quarters, around which a city was built. See also Jukurigazu, Chuzambel, Step Pyramid, Pyramid, The Ziggurat, References, Notes Bibliography T. Bizink Lana Guinea Copyright Volution de la Ziggurat Babylonienne. J. 
Jar Bereicht van het Verwaarsietische Egyptische Genomwetschap ex Orient Lux 21, 91 to 141. A Chadwick, Calendars, Ziggurats, and the Stars. The Canadian Society for Mesopotamian Studies Bulletin 24, 7 to 24. A G. Killick, Ziggurat. The Dictionary of Art, Volume 33, 675 to 676. H. J. Lenzen, Die Entwicklung der Zikurat von Ihrer Name für Currency in Gen bis der 3. Dynasty von Er, M. Rofe, Cultural Atlas of Mesopotamia and the Ancient Near East, 104-107. E. C. Stone, Zikurat. The Oxford Encyclopedia of Archaeology in the Near East, Volume 5, 390-391. J. A. Black and A. Green, Zikurat. Dictionary of the Ancient Near East, 327 to 328. Harriet Crawford, Summer and the Sumerians, Cambridge University Press, ISBN 0 521 38850 3. A. Leo Oppenheim, Ancient Mesopotamia, University of Chicago Press, ISBN 0 226 63187 7. Beck, Roger B. Linda Black, Larry S. Greger, Philip C. Naylor, Dalibo Schaubacher. World History, Patterns of Interaction. Evanston, Illinois, McDougall Littell. ISBN A 0 395 Exa, Leak, Gwendolyn. Mesopotamia, The Invention of the City. Penguin Books. ISBN A 0 14 026574 0. External links, media related to ziggurats at Wikimedia Commons, website of Choker Zombel Ziggurat, Iran. Article on status of Shialk Ziggurat, Iran.